hey you, stop what you're doing and look at what we're doing because it's funner. This is my friend and roommate, JP. Hello everybody. This evening, JP and I are going to be making an unseasonal Halloween cocktail. Yes. Here's the ingredients that you will need. Brandy's Irish cream. Pure pumpkin butter by Madford Farms. Ice from water. And cherries, real cherries from fruit. Let's begin. So the first step is to take a small bowl like this one and mash up the cherries inside of it. Are they seeded? I don't know if they're seeded. They probably are. Maybe you want their fork then. Okay, so that is going to be one element. The other element, first you'll take your blender, take your pumpkin butter, and put a bunch into your blender. I've never made this before, so I'm just guessing this much. If, if like me, you've just flung some pumpkin all over the place, it's okay. Nobody's allergic to pumpkin. Right. I love pumpkin! Oh, you can totally fish the seeds out. Is that working? Yeah, it's working. Yes! Yes! Next, you want to put a bunch of ice in it. This is around the time of the evening that we get a little adult with our ingredients. And put a bunch of this stuff in it. Goodness, that's a lot. Maybe a little bit more. Yay, drunk! And then you blend it. Finished. This is hard to do. Um, Bailey's heavy. Make sure you get your Bailey's to pumpkin ratio correct. Or brandy. Whatever it is. This is impossible. Nothing is impossible. Blend it again. Okay, I'm gonna try this now. It's good. It's really. It just needs a little bit more pumpkin. So you'll need a lot more pumpkin you, than you expected to need. That's okay. Pumpkin makes everything better. My mouth has been on everything in this kitchen. Uh-huh, there it is. Damn it. Wow. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Hey, do you want to try some? Yes. Oh, fuck, oh, fuck yeah. This is going to be good. Ooh, it's really pumpkin. Very pumpkin. Did you put a little bit of water in it? No. We'll do that. Come in. So once you've poured your pumpkin mix into your cup, you then want to take the cherries and drizzle your juices over the top of them. <laughs> Just believe. At this point, it'll start looking like an abortion. Remember that. And there you have bleeding, bleeding pumpkin, pumpkin abortion. abortion. JP, would you like to be the first to try the bleeding pumpkin abortion? Yes. Here it goes. Delicious. Damn, that's good. Damn it. Damn it to hell, that is good. So now, kids, go home and make a bleeding pumpkin abortion. 
And don't be afraid to get real creative with yourselves, sexually and alcoholically, especially at the young age that you are at. Latest potatoes. Bye. <laughs>